Hello and welcome to this Fast Track How To video. Today I'm going to take you through the controls and settings for the PTO. Let's take a look. To activate our rear PTO, we first need to select a PTO speed. Select a speed from the B pillar. In this example, we're going to run in 540. Wait for the red light to stop flashing. To turn the PTO on, press the yellow button in and push forward. The current PTO speed is indicated on the touchscreen. To turn the PTO off, simply just push down on the switch. The seat has a PTO safety cutout switch fitted into it. When the PTO is running, and we leave the seat, this warning will appear. Press the tick, which will keep the PTO running and allows us to step outside. To turn the seat switch off, go into our tractor settings page, select the yellow cutout icon, and then select the rear PTO. We then want to turn the seat switch off. Select this icon, use the minus button, and then click save. With the seat switch deactivated, the PTO will remain on when you leave the seat without showing you the warning. Please remember, when the tractor is turned off, the PTO seat switch will default back to active. Once the PTO has been turned on manually in the cab, it can then be controlled using the external fender buttons. To turn the PTO off, Press the yellow button once. To turn back on, press once, then press and hold until the PTO starts up. Thank you for watching this Fast Track how to video. Please remember, always refer to your operator's manual for more details. Join us again next time for another Fast Track how to.